Hey crafters, this is Muriel. So yesterday I had a D stash. It was a shabby chic lot. It sold for thirty dollars, really fast. And I had someone reach out to me and ask if I could um, make another one that they would buy it. So I went back in my shabby chic drawer and kind of pulled things as much as I could. And um, I haven't heard back from this person yet. So I have this lot. If you are interested, this is first come, first serve. This is a shabby chic lot. It is US only, PayPal only. It is $30 shipped. Let me show you what is in the lot. I have some I Am Roses flowers. I just put together a couple of these beautiful uh, pinks and greens and tan and cream color flowers. I have some Prima leaves. I have some washi tape that I thought was really shabby colors. Um, this, you can see it's all ready to go, are some embellishments by Melissa Francis. So you'll get those three, two crowns and a butterfly. And then there is the rose. And then there are these three here that say keepsake, scrapbook, and remember this. You're going to get these little packs of flowers. These are vintage ladies on camera, on canvas, and there's about six of them in the pack. A wooden flourish of a dress form. Melissa Francis vintage buttons. Melissa Francis glass magnets. Melissa Francis sweet treat bags, and there are four bags in here. There are two seven and a half by five, and two five and a third by three and a half. Okay, this is a Melissa Francis spray. A pack of glass buttons, Melissa Francis. Now, in the other lot were three little ballerinas. I don't have any more of those, so I substituted with three of these bird nests. This is Melissa Francis trim. It's like a coral color. Um, the other pack had a pack of tile. I only have two of these. White pom-pom trim, and there's about seven of them that you can separate and use. Then I have a pack of trims that I put together. There's a wide scallop, two inch, two and a half inch wide, and then the other ones. So there's five in here total. Then there is a pack of self-sealing bags, 50 count. There is a bag of, let's see if I can open this. These are um, some beautiful um, bling pieces. So you can kind of see there, this beautiful piece here, this beautiful piece, that piece, and then these other um, three. Okay. And then lastly, there was, was in the other uh, D-stash some art paper but I didn't have any more. Like I said, I wasn't planning on making another one, but I did. So I uh, cut out some Prima Romantique collection. Um, this is double-sided, so it's really shabby papers. These are six by six. And then last, I put together a jar of um, buttons. And this is from, oh God, what is her name? I can't even think of the um, pretty posh, pretty pink posh. So there are uh, pink ones, peppermint color, vintage color, and a um, what they call a steel blue in this jar. So if you're interested in this D stash, again, this is first come first serve. I will, um, you can put your comment down below and then I will send you my um, PayPal address. Um, I don't know the young lady that said she wanted it. I've been trying to reach her since this morning. And um, I know most of you ladies don't, 
you're not as patient as I am you say within the next hour and I see why you say that because I like to pack it up move it out and I don't want to wait I'm trying to clean I'm I'm doing lots of stuff so I don't want to hold on to this so if you're interested just let me know and it will be in the mail to you uh, tomorrow morning thanks again for watching bye now